welcome back to the IBSP. Here's your host, Foxy New. Virgil Ortiz ends Errol Spence Jr. And look, let's break it down honestly and objectively as possible. And Oscar De La Hoya has come out and made an interesting statement. He states, I have huge plans for Virgil Ortiz fight announcement coming soon. But first, let's imagine an all-Dallas showdown versus Errol Spence Jr. Now, this is a fight that's been simmering for quite a while. People have been talking about it, and this would be a massive fight for the state of Texas and the nation. Virgil Ortiz versus Errol Spence Jr. Both of these guys are at 150. 54 pounds now and this fight has been talked about for years since these guys were both at 147 I mean let's go back to 2020 when Virgil Ortiz was stating I think I'll be ready for Errol Spence in less than two years 2021 Virgil Ortiz stated Spence and I are, are cool and we know there's potential for a fight between us one day 2022 Virgil Ortiz says he wants to Spence fight next and says it will be the biggest fight in Texas history and that would be a massive fight and you fast forward to today, where Oscar's talking about the fight, wanting to make the fight, and obviously it can't be next. Both of these guys are on different paths at the moment, but it can definitely happen in 2025. That fight makes a lot of sense. It's a huge money fight. It's a stadium fight, and the whole state of Texas will get behind that fight. That's a massive fight, and, I, and it's really to break down, easy to break down for me. When you look at the fight, you look at it, both of these guys are warriors in the ring, so I respect Errol Spence. I respect respect Virgil Ortiz, but we got to break it down objectively. And objectively is Virgil Ortiz ends this man's entire career. Errol Spence Jr. is not going to be able to withstand the power, the pressure from Virgil Ortiz. He does not have the defensive ability to be able to avoid those massive shots. And he can't take those shots. Virgil Ortiz will finish him, beat him, and destroy him worse than Terrence Crawford did. I mean, this will look ugly. He will end Errol Spence's career. This will be nothing like the Terrence Crawford fight. Terrence Crawford destroyed him as well. All the credit in the world to Bud. But Virgil Ortiz is a different monster with different power. So when you see Virgil Ortiz run through Errol Spence, he's going to be hitting this man with devastating shots. Errol Spence will not get up off the canvas multiple times from the power that Virgil Ortiz has. I mean, we've seen Mean Machine, the same guy who fought Virgil Ortiz and Terrence Crawford, go on record and state that Terrence Crawford don't have the power or the jab that Virgil Ortiz has. Believe me or not, Virgil Ortiz is a top fighter, an elite fighter, and he's ready to show it.